Hey there, I'm Shen, Global Head of Product here at HTC. Here again to tell you about what's coming up in our next software update for Vive XR Elite, Photo 5. Let's dive straight in with some new features. We've enabled the depth sensor in our beta branch for a while now, and in Photo 5, we'll be making it public. You'll be able to use it to scan a mesh of your room, which can be used by mixed reality content. And it will also auto detect physical walls and tables, which is used by experiences like Yuki, where portals spawn directly on your walls. And this is just the start. We have plans to expand the abilities of the depth sensor in the future. We will also be releasing our own mixed reality demo, Jailbu, which we'll be showing at events. It was built to show off a variety of interactions you can do with mixed reality and hand tracking. It will be released through Viveport so you can give it a go, link in the description once it's up. We also open source this demo for developers to take a look at as well. We'll also link that below. In our previous update, we released our new Vive video application on Viveport for you to watch all kinds of video formats, including stereoscopic 360 videos, and have been pleased with the reception and taking on suggestions for future updates. In Photo 5, we'll also now be able to support the ability to view 360 photos directly in the Vive system software. Now, onto some quality of life improvements. Our tracking system will now notify you if your surroundings is a little bit too dark for decent tracking, or sometimes to even track at all. This is especially useful for those who may play a session through sunset and suddenly find their tracking deteriorate as the room gets super dark. This update also comes with a new controller firmware, which fixes a standby bug, which occasionally causes controllers to stay awake and consume too much power when used. A big thanks to our users who were affected by this and reached out to us about it. Focus 3 users, you'll also get this new firmware in the next update for Focus 3. And a really nice quality of life we added to Photo 5 is you'll no longer need to manually trigger a restart to finalize the install of future system updates. In the future, you can just accept the software update and it will automatically download, install, and reboot the headset. Lastly, We've also added some more onboarding tips for users to really get to know how to use their library. This should really help new users to get to know the XR Elite. Photo 5 will be released in the coming week. We'd love to hear your feedback on what features and changes you'd like to see in future updates. You can reach out to us through our official Discord channel where you can find myself and CT from our engineering team or leave a comment down below. See you next time.